Okay, everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, uh, I came with another video tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix uh, if your Adobe freezes while rendering your videos. So first of all, you need to know what causing this problem. Usually, there are two reasons why this happen. One, it's because some of the effects you're using in your video or two, uh, it's because the video itself so you need to know what causing this problem in your in your case in your scenario you need to know that uh, if Adobe freezes because some of the effect you can try to remove some of the effect and see if that's working or in my case I know that uh, my problem here is because of my video itself I don't know maybe it's because uh, there's something wrong with the video encoding setting I don't know but yeah I know that uh, what causing this problem in my case is the video itself so it's between these two videos right here this one and this one yeah, yeah it's between these two videos so yeah if you're having the same problem with me um, you can just follow my step I'm gonna set marker out so I'm just gonna render these two videos not the whole video not the whole project so yeah I'm gonna render and see what happen if I render this video is it gonna freeze or not I'm gonna call this video a test video um, nope test video let's just call it test video for now I'm gonna render render it as 1080p 30 fps and yeah let's see what happened if I render okay so it freezes right here it's not gonna move any further uh, it's four minutes and 20 seconds left on the clock and I'm gonna wait maybe a minute or two minutes uh, to see if this is really freezing okay so I've been waiting uh, I don't know maybe about a minute and yeah it's still freezing it's not moving at all uh, so yeah right now I'm gonna cancel the render Let's see what happens if I cancel. It's gonna freeze or gonna crash, I think. Yep, it's it's crash. Yep, it's, it's not responding there, as you guys can see. And yeah, I'm just gonna end task. Okay, so right now I'm gonna see the video that I just rendered. Uh, I need to know where the exact point the problem is. Where is the video? I think it's this one, right? Yeah. Let's see where the problem is. Yeah, it's right end of on the first clip the video happened. The error happened, I mean. Okay, it freezes right here. So I know that's the that's where the problem is. Okay, so if you're having the same problem with me here, if you know that the crash or Adobe freezes is because the video itself, my way on how to fix this is which is just to re-encode the video and yeah you can use uh, software like handbrake in this video i'm gonna use handbrake it's free to download so don't worry i'm gonna put link in the description you can just download this app or software and yeah i'm gonna use this app to re-encode my video uh, you can open the file manually from here or you can simply just drag and drop the video you want to handbrake which is what I'm gonna do where is it silhouette walk this one I'm gonna drag and drop to the handbrake <clears throat> and yeah there are so many presets you can choose from here but in my case I'm just going to use 1080p 30 fps you can always go higher than that of course it's up to you or you can also set the setting manually if you want to but in this video in this case I'm just gonna use 10 rp 30 fps and yeah okay so on the video tab 
you can change the constant quality here if you set the slider here to the right uh, your video gonna have a higher quality but also higher size higher size of course but if you set this slider to the left you gonna your video gonna have a lower quality but smaller video size of course uh, one thing you need to pay attention is on dimension tab there is a cropping option here uh, it's automatic right now but I'm gonna change it to none I don't want automatic because so if I set it to automatic uh, sometime handbrake gonna crop my video and I don't want that so I'm just gonna change it to none so handbrake will not crop my video and yeah once you're done with all the settings you want um, you can all, you can set the destination of the output video to whatever you want. I'm just gonna save it to my folder here, and I'm just gonna rename it. I don't know, handbrake silhouette walk, I guess. And yeah, once you're ready, uh, you can start encode by pressing this button here. Start encode. Okay, I'm get, I'm gonna start encode now. <clears throat> and yeah, let's wait until the encoding is done. Okay, so once you're done encoding your uh, your video, you can just drag and drop the your new video, your handbrake new video to your project and change it uh, change the error video with the new one okay this is this is my video right here this two video handbrake uh, silhouette walk and handbrake waterfall and yeah, i'm just gonna drag and drop to my project and change the problematic video to the new one that i just encode and see if that fix Okay, I just replaced my video to the new one that I just encode. And yeah, let's just render the video out again. Let's see if it's working now. And before that, uh, I want to set marker. Uh, marker out to make sure that it's only rendering these two videos. Okay. Let's see what's going to happen if I render it now. <clears throat> Um, uh, no, actually, I'm gonna rename it. I'm gonna name it Taste Video One. Okay, let's just export it and see what's gonna happen now. And yeah, just like that, now it's working again. So, if you're having the same problem with me, you know that the problem is in the video itself. All you have to do is just re-encode the re -encode your video. So, yeah, you can use handbrake like me. Just follow my step and you should be fine. And let's see the video now. <coughs> yep everything looks good so far it's not freezing anymore yeah okay yeah it's fixed so that's all actually you gotta do is just uh, re-encode your video okay everything went great and this video is now fixed and yeah that's actually pretty much it so the point is if you're having the same problem with me uh, all you have to do is just re-encode the video using handbrake in this case i'm using handbrake so i don't know maybe it's because there's something wrong with the video encoding setting that causing adobe freezes while rendering your video i'm not sure 
uh, and yeah if you just re-encode your video it's gonna be fine like me and I think that's pretty much it for today's video I'm gonna end this video right here if you think my video was helpful why don't you give this video a thumbs up share this video and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching as always see ya